Tiamari opened up for the first time about her eldest son's penatology and how stressful and traumatic the diagnosis can be for families. The actress recently gave birth to her second child and she also gets candid about being a mother of two. Tia Mari has become an exemplary Instagram mom by sharing pieces of advice, tips and product recommendations with other moms through her social media. She often talks about her motherhood experience, hoping to help other moms out there. And in her most recent post, she talked about allergies, specifically about peanut allergies, a condition that affects one in every 50 children in America, for a total of nearly 1.5 million kids living with it to this day. Her eldest son, Cree, is one of those kids, and that's why Mary partnered with DBV Technologies, a global clinical stage biopharmaceutical company focused on food allergies. That's looking to raise awareness about the severe life-threatening consequences that peanut allergy can bring to a child's life. My son Cree is one of one and a half million children in the US living with peanut allergy. Is a peanut allergy really that serious? The simple answer is yes. The former sister sister actress wrote on an Instagram post and continued, exposure of even trace amounts of peanuts can trigger a potentially severe life-threatening reaction and that's stressful for children and their parents. Avoidance isn't always possible and never make a decision about where Cree goes or what he eats without considering the risk of exposure. Cree was diagnosed when he was three years old in what Mary described as a trust, stressful and traumatic experience. She was putting her son to bed when she noticed some hives on his hands and arms, as she recalled in a video for the Talking Peanut Allergy campaign. A motherly instinct kicked in and said, this is not right, something's wrong, she said. After taking her son to the emergency room, doctors advised her to seek the opinion of an allergist who diagnosed Cree with a peanut allergy. I knew right then and there that our lives were going to be changed, said the 40-year-old. I knew right then and there that our family dynamic and what we do on a day-to-day -day basis is going to be different. Caring for a child with a peanut allergy requires a lot of effort from family and teachers, friends and acquaintances have to get involved in the process of looking out for everything the child eats or touches, as even the slightest risk of cross-contact can lead to life-threatening reactions. Thanks for listening. Please like, comment and subscribe.